Hey friends, today is the opening day of Disney Springs. I am super excited to be here. I want to check out everything. Right now it is 10 a.m. and it's not too busy at all here. Temperature checks are right behind me. So we're going to go through there, get our temperature checked, and then get down into the springs. So let's go do this. And it looks like we're going back into the garage. Thanks! <laughs> And a nice little loop around. Welcome back to the Thank you. <laughs> we need to be wearing our face mask, get our temperatures checked, and also practice the physical distancing. It's really cool that Advent Health is actually performing all the temperature screenings. I think that's awesome. Good morning. I can't wait to pull your hat up. Oh, so yes. Little. I'm going to get close, but I will not touch you. Thank you! <laughs> that was pretty simple and very easy. No lines, nothing like that. Everybody seems to be already complying with the social distancing, I have to say. They even have someone monitoring the escalators so that they're not jammed up. I think that is super cool. And plus he's wiping the banister with sanitizer as it's going like round and round. That is what we have been missing. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. It feels so great to be back in Disney Springs or just out doing something. And I don't mind the mat so far. It's only been 10 minutes and I really can't judge that. But I got my sanitizer with me. Much better sanitizer. This is from the Beard and Company. Advanced hand sanitizer. I like it. And just take a look at those crystal clear springs. Beautiful. Seriously though, I thought there would be a lot more people here. It's been open since 8 a.m. They've been letting people in and it is now 10.06. Not too many people at all. A lot of helicopters trying to get some aerial shots going on though. Oh look, there's Blaze Pizza. Huh, wow. Seriously, I, I don't see anybody here. It's a little shocking, but it's good. Ran into a group of people here. Look at this, World of Micah. What's up, Paging Mr. Morrow? <laughs> then we got Danny702, Tampa J, Jackie Super Enthused, Vincent Vision, and the cool kids. <laughs> they have little arrows that's pointing the direction you should walk. So keep to the right if you're heading this way, and then go to the left if you're going this way. And look, people are actually evading by them. And once again, the springs are beautiful. One thing I think I really want to check out is actually heading to Joffrey's to get some Joffrey's coffee because technically today's like the first day that we can get it. So that gets me a little bit excited. As we make our journey over to Joffrey's, you notice it's starting to pick up a little bit more over here. A lot more people heading to the other side of actual Disney Springs. The line to get into Joffrey's isn't too bad. It just looks bad because of everyone that's practicing the social distancing and actually staying exactly on their markers. But it looks like we're about four, four separators or four markers away. Oh, here we are. Are they little coffee beans? Oh, the markings for social distancing is coffee beans, I think. Yeah, she said, come on in and stand on the next coffee bean. So, <laughs> inside the top, you stand on the coffee beans. I like that. Really cool. Whoa! I like <laughs> Normally, I would definitely go with my normal Starbucks Nitro Cold Brew, but like I said, you're at Disney Springs for the first time in a while. Might as well come to Joffrey's and I'm going to try their Nitro. I have my Nitro, I'm excited, and now I'm going to either go down by the water or just kind of tuck away to the side there so I can just take my mask off and drink it and not be in any social gathering areas. And we found a nice little place to come sit over here where there's nobody around and we can enjoy our coffees. Now that's what they recommend to do if you are drinking or anything like that. Just don't be in the common areas. Like over there there's a gigantic line of people waiting to get into the boathouse. And uh, we don't want to be standing over there drinking our coffees. 
Look at how we are all hanging out socially distancing. <laughs> like, on, n this wasn't planned either. This literally just fell this way. Everyone just like sat, but within the distance amount. Perfectly. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> In fact, as I take a, a little bit more of a look, this is the first line I've actually seen all day at Disney Springs. And it's a line to get into Boathouse. Look at that, crazy. Goes all the way back. I think we're gonna move along a little bit. We do have a lunch reservation at STK, but before we head over there, I wanted to come over here and take a look at characters in flight or aerophile, and then just look at the water itself. It is such a beautiful day out. Wonderful day for Disney Springs to reopen. Look at this, I love it. <laughs> And now we are in line for STK, and definitely not as long as line as the boathouse. Wow, this is it. Much more better. Everybody is doing their social distancing. Looks very good. Here is a look at the menu. It's the all day menu, and I don't know if this is different, but this is exactly what they're serving. That's what I'm gonna get, tuna tartar, baby. Oh, you're getting the tuna tartar, huh? Wa Wagyu burger. You're going with the Wagyu burger? Yeah. Oh, very interesting. Yeah, not too bad. Ten bucks. Wow, you can't beat that at all. They have a Wagyu hot dog for ten bucks too. Oh, so excited. Which way do we go? Oh, wow, it's so pretty in here. Thank you. And we do have a health and safety advisory right there. Look at how beautiful it is in here and they're doing a really good job with the social distancing They have every other table marked off that you can't sit here You can sit there and you see they have the arrows and actually the X's mean from one X to another is six feet so if a table sitting here They can't sit there even though they're both open and a part of every other table But because they're within six feet you can't sit there and now that we are officially seated at our table, it's time for the unmasking and my glasses. My glasses got stuck. And a part of the grand reopening here, they gave out these little cards for one complimentary standard drink at the bar. That is pretty awesome. So I think what I'm gonna go with is the steak sandwich and they have this nifty little lunch special menu and look at that Like uh, before we said the burger was only 10 bucks and the steak sandwich is only $19 a shaved coffee rubbed ribeye with caramelized onions. I'm not getting the horseradish cream though probably <laughs> along with my steak sandwich. I wanted to get a Bud Light, but they're not serving any Bud Light at this time. So I'm gonna get a Corona Light. I don't think I've ever had a Corona Light before. I hope it's good. Jackie went all in and she got a Bloody Mary and Vincent's got the water. <laughs> the delicious water is hot outside. Yes, it's very hot. Stay hydrated. <laughs> Stay hydrated, H2O. <laughs> They had no Corona light, so no Bud Light, no Corona light. Instead, I went with the Modelo, which I've had this before. I do really like it. And uh, I got a nifty little glass. I got my sanitizer already <laughs> spritzed up. Let's do this. And the food is here. We're going to slide this out of the way. Right there, gentle. Oh, wow, that looks Thank amazing. You. Look at Jackie's food. Tuna tartar. Tuna avocado, tartar. Tuna, some like yuca chips. Fancy. Vincent's got the wagyu, wagyu, wag burger, wag burger. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk about it. And there it is. Look at that. A little bit of au jus. Oh, au I'm gonna jus. love this. Oh yeah, that looks great. I am gonna love this. The bread is so soft. Oh boy, you gotta dip it in there. Oh bump, yeah. Bump. And I'm going in. He's going in. He's going in. Oh, you big boss. <laughs> 
That is the best steak sandwich I actually ever had. I'm like really impressed with it. Wow, unbelievable. I legit don't want this sandwich to end. <laughs> I really, I'm, I'm even considering ordering another one, but I think that's a little, that's a little much. If it was, if it wasn't lunch and it was dinner, I think I'd be like, can I have two steak sandwiches, please? <laughs> another for dessert. <laughs> yes, I'll have another. I'll have another. <laughs> and now it's time to cash out. Look at how fancy this is. Table safe, and they have a little plastic wrap on it. You could just insert your card. And my bill came to thirty-three fifty-five. That's not too bad. Yeah. Two beers and a steak sandwich with a discount. Thank you. All finished up at STK. Phenomenal. I absolutely loved it. The mask is back on yeah. and I'm ready to uh, head out or make my way out of here. And take a look on the way out. Almost hardly nobody here and it's 1230. Before we actually leave, I want to show you down here near Splitsville and AMC. There's nothing open down here yet, but they do have the signage up. Hopefully the movie theater is going to open up soon. At least they're preparing for it. And almost all of the shops, they're not open yet. It just seems like very quiet over on this side of the park or Disney Springs. And I think that's going to do it for me. Like I said, it was just a little fun day out today. We got to check out STK, go to Joffrey's, and just enjoy Disney Springs. I'm just happy that something's open and that we can get some kind of normalcy back. Anywho's, I hope you enjoyed the vlog. I enjoyed making it. So, we'll see you next time. Bye!